Righto Metalhead, so um, after reviewing the footage from last week, I was a bit unhappy with a target that I walked away from. This is where I was, I don't know if you can say that. But yeah, unhappy, so. I mean, I'm not unhappy, I'm, I, I think I just missed something, so I'll put the video on the screen now. And I'll let you judge, I'll let you judge whether or not I should have walked away from it or not. Well, seems like I got a little bit closer to that. Well, <laughs> I did leave it for a reason. Oh, well, it was worth, it, to put my mind at ease, it was worth coming back. I mean, I made a bit of a mess here, but like I said, worth it. <laughs> All right, so. A V bottle top. That's what my brain has been thinking about this entire time. I don't know if you can see down there, but that's some area. So yeah, today we're gonna do like, we're gonna walk pretty much that way and just do where we can because apparently this is where they docked the ship back in the day. So we'll get back to you on the second line. <laughs> Where'd me nice signal go? There you go, 62, 63. Maybe old mate that pitched his little, pitched his little fire. He can made his little fire, drop the dollar. More likely a bottle top. Nope, he dropped the dollar. Well, that's not a good start. I mean, it's a dollar an hour so far, and it's a variant too. Thanks, mate. I mean, I'm, I don't mind cleaning up your um, bowl tops when you give me some coins for doing it. I'll get out of it. No, that's punchy. Maybe it was worth coming in here. That will be... That's possibly a second dollar. So... So that or a bowl top. And it is not a bottle top. Two bucks. I mean, it's a dollar, but that's two dollars now. Cool, and another variant. I can't see for the life of me. He's probably can't even see me in here. I'm that amongst it. But yeah. I'll get out of it. That could be another dollar. Why don't you come in? A show of hands, who wants to see the film I have to detect one of these days? <laughs> that's a 63 and I'm pretty sure that's going to be my third buck. Bit more. It's a bit deeper this one. Just slightly deeper. Can you see that? Are you glad you come in here? That's not a dollar, that is two dollars. That brings the total to four bucks in what, five minutes? Lovely, glad we come in here. Thank you kids, thank you parents. Well, the light works, doesn't it? Another one? Get out of it, Eve. for real? It could be another one. Seems a bit sketchier, but it's still in the 60s, so we could be on to a dollar two dollars bill here. We are. Another two bucks. Well, how much is that? It's like five, six bucks in a matter of like five or 10 minutes. I'm not gonna complain and I don't know how, I don't know how the computer's gonna pick me up with that bloody light shining in my face, but 
five bucks, five minutes, lovely. We have a bit of a sketch first. 86. Good deeper, huh? Good deeper than your average target, they say. Oh, well, there you go, champion. I don't know if I said it before, but well, mate Garrett has a few knocks on its head, and I think I might have to whip out the um, our mine lab, our mine lab bloody pinpointer at some point. Oh, yeah. it's old at least. We are we're planting cans. <laughs> yeah, and I'm better off just going in here now and just. Sort me life out in here, eh? I don't know, you're looking at 68. 68, mate. Why would there be... Why would there be mad coins up here? I don't know, but I'm very willing to find them for you. I'll just say that. Did you just say that pop out? Can you say that anyway? Old oh, mate's not very good on the on the ball today, but that is another coin. I think it's a one cent. Yes, it is. Lovely. I thought I didn't. I didn't think that was actually going to be a coin. I wasn't actually going to come up in here, but. That is. 55, 56. Quite, quite solid. Ooh. Oh, rakes are pissing in. Jesus Christ. Ah, well. We have not found a carabiner in a while, have we? Cool. Can that just stay in that one? Oh, would you get out of it? 20 cents, eh? That's not what I was expecting to find at all. You know what I really want to find? A 50 that looks like this. This is right next to the 20 cent. Old mate just put it away. That's a... 68. I mean, this could be multiple coins. It's ringing up quite, quite erratically. All right, just see that pop out. There's one. That's a variant as well. Uh, 2008. Some kind of variant. I'm not going to sit here all day. And, but I, can, I, I bet you, I bet you there's another one. I, I, I can almost guarantee that there's another one. Oh, what's that? I just said it. Another 20 cents. <laughs> Most 20 cent piece to be found in a while. 2021. Lovely. Now, do you think that's it? Because I'm not sure if that's it. Hey, we're on the real, we're on the real money today. I mean, it's all real money, but on the modern stuff. Oh, that was it. Cool. That's a semi solid. That's a semi solid 52, 53. This isn't a coin, it's gonna be a ball top. Or a bloody ring. I can't see any um, markings on this ring. It's probably just a, probably just a, um, a decorative thing, but looks cool. I haven't found a ring in a while. That does look like a bit of a stain, doesn't it? I don't know. 
I could be a lot more excited when I wash this up. Cool, who would have thought? Look where it is. Probably another can. You believe? It's an old one. Carrots. Orange. There it is. Tristram's. Bent nice and awkward for someone walking down the stairs, isn't it? Uh, that's enough of the cans. Oh, now we gotta get down. What's got here? Oh, just that. There you go. There's another two dollar. Yeah, definitely at um, school money today. 1988. Nicely preserved two dollar. You know what? Get me a beer and barley. An 81, 82. Oh, get out. What's that look like to you? Nice little, nice little buckle for you. What do you expect being that deep? It wasn't gonna be a bloody $2, was it? Oh, well, that's like unexpected to find stuff here. I thought we'd find nothing on this little grassy patch, but what do you bloody know? Oh, there's that in there somewhere. Doesn't seem huge. Good sign. Yeah, nice. A 1941 Rue Penny. So, this carrot, I'm telling you right now, needs to be replaced. I mean, I already replaced it, but I just don't use the other. Pinpoint a door. Ah, oh, what's that? The top half of a key. All right, so what do we got here? A 90, a 94 actually. It's one by down, so. Not banking on anything amazing. <laughs> this is the biggest coin I've ever found. <laughs> 1005 2072. Yeah, all right, you can have it, champ. Here you go. I don't like go out of my way to wreck people's gardens, you know? It's not even in the garden, so get out of it. Oh, there's a worm. Where is he? God damn it, every time I find a worm, pies are not there. Oh, there's another one. Well, oh, maybe it isn't. Yeah, no, it is. So I don't know what these are. Um, I will put them on the screen. Someone will enlighten me, I'm sure. This one just has a whole bunch of writing on it. 
Mark it hit. That's a 63 and valid coins on my mind. What about you? Huh? Pool tab? Get out of it. It'd have to be a very highly decorative pool tab. Pull this over here so they get run over. I wasn't supposed to take this long. Ready, set. Ready, set. <laughs> oh, jeez, Louise, that's close. It's a bloody bowl top. Wasn't worth my life, was it? <laughs> I'd say 70, but, you know, everything's, everything's just wrong about that. <laughs> oh my God, except for that got onto it straight away. No effort involved, except for the old news. Oh, we're on the curb, aren't we? All those kind of people. <laughs> oh, get out of it. That was so, so deep. Like, for a dollar, look. My whole fifty fits in it. Uh, variant. Australia, obviously, 1999. 80.81. Oh, that's a bit sludgy, isn't it? Um, all right. Part of a fishing rod. It's a, it's a, that, what in the world? We found fishing reels, sinkers, hooks. That, that to me, it looks like part of a fishing rod, doesn't it? Well, I thought that was a small target. I'm real good. We got another foreign coin. Are you are you serious? I had no clue. So sixty one. So that could have been an Australian dollar for all I bloody know. But pulled. I thought it was going to be a medal with that. Oh, Samoa. Yeet. So we've worked it out. It is a, a nineteen. 84 Samoan Tulla. I don't know if you can see that. I swear I always say that. That is three weeks in a row with foreign currency. I, I just, it's, it's, I feel like I make it up, eh? Anyway, mad. So I've got a 64, 65, something along those lines. Pretty close to the old Samoan Tala or dollar, whatever. I'm gonna say it's a 66. Pretty close to the surface according to the old uh, detector. Get it out, damn it. I was some own teller on the Australian dollar. A pressure test of some sort. Too bad there's no date on it. Oh, look at this. Where are you going, mate? There you go. 
Get you back in your house and bury her. I'd say 64, 65. What's with us and going like somewhat vertical so many times this weekend? Finding vertical targets is a bit of a nightmare sometimes, eh? There you go. Oh, there you go. It's a funny looking bloody key, isn't it? Look at that. Oh well, a couple of keys, can't complain. That's a 60 61. That is a, I oh know, that is, <laughs> that's a padlock split in half. Like usually you see them broken at the top, but that's literally split in half. I was say, it's a funny looking padlock. I never thought that there would be one signal on this hill, let alone 15 million. Oh. <laughs> That's the other half. Give me the other. Too bad you can't find that other. Oh, that's cool. That's the other half of the padlock. Now we just need to find the little round bit. I, I can't believe that we just found the other half of the padlock. Like that, that's not amazing, but like it's, it is a little bit. Anyway, got a, got a bit of an audience. I don't care. Honestly, when I find something, I really couldn't care about the people watching. <laughs> You are going to, oh, hold on. It is. Are you for real? Is this the other half of the fishing rod? <laughs> I didn't even think anything of it. I thought it was a stick. I seen the saw. I was like, oh yeah, that's cool. Hold on. <laughs> Let's try. Are you serious right now? If there wasn't dirt in there, that would probably go straight in. I can actually say, I found a fishing rod. Can you believe it? That's <laughs> what are we finding? We're finding so much crap. Um, yeah, so they kind of seem makeshift, don't they? They're completely different. Anyway, that's that's a double sinker, sure. I, <laughs> I can use this on my new rod. What do you reckon? Not only are we catching metals though, we might catch a few fish. At first I thought pull tab, no, did not ring, no. Yeah, oh no. Woody from Toy Story, yeah. Well, there's a snake in my bed. Yeah, I don't know, I haven't found something like that before. It's different, it's unusual. Well, that is an old draw knob. That seems oldish. I mean, I was just saying how there's not really much in here. Like, it's just all new rubbish, but I don't know. Bit of hope, I suppose. Probably not gonna last much longer, to be honest. That would be 
62, 63. I reckon this is going to be our last, our last uh, dig because I'm feeling a bit, feeling a bit ruined. Bloody hungry too, eh? Bloody starving. Well, the last target looks to me like a broken hook. What do you reckon? Picture frame, hook from a picture frame, whatever. Same sh different smell. Anyway, uh, yeah, it's getting to the point where if I don't stand up, my knees aren't gonna work anymore. So we've had quite the day. Uh, it's been quite the weekend. So yeah, next weekend, come back out and rain been quite nice it's been the weather's been nice it's been nice and even in the rain it's been nice and cold so with that hook we will see you next week